Hey, guys. How you doing? Hey, what's on your mind, Dave, in New York? Uh, I'm about ready to dump my girlfriend. Okay. Oh, really? Relationship Why is that? advice? Uh, because whenever, like, like, say I want to go out and do something, like hang with friends, maybe run some errands, maybe go to the mall and pick something up, or maybe go and get my mail at the mailbox, whatever, do, mm-hmm. do stuff, whatever. I text her, call her. She is never, ever around. Oh, but when she has things that she needs to be done, like maybe helping with the laundry, food shopping, or this, it's always, can you take me here? Can you take me there? Take me here? It's always about her, 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 never about what I want. It's always about what she needs, never about what I want to do. It's always, it's always her, 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 and not me, now, me, have, me. You have know? you talked but, to her about this, Dave? Not yet, but I'm planning on it. Okay. Um, That'd probably be the first place to start. You know, I'm not an expert, but... Oh, but I am. I mean, hell, I I mean, heck, I've had 124 relationships, and I got the spreadsheet to prove it. So... Wow, really? Oh, yes. That's a lot James of relationships. Is a, but, you know, James is 100 number 24, and I'm hoping this one is the last one. <laughs> yeah, he's got Damn. a lot of I metrics like, on him, you know, too. I, I, I want to go and, like, you know, do stuff, hang out with friends, maybe go to a bar or whatever stuff, and I, and I text you, like, oh, hey, you want to go hang out? You want to go this or do that? I don't hear from her from days and days on end. Oh, but days when and she days. Something done, Maybe she's yeah, cheating on like, you, Dave. It's, it's like we, no, she's not cheating on me. But uh, when, it's like I, I never. Where hear does from she her live? Wait a minute. Where, where does she live? Where do I mean? You live in Poughkeepsie, New York. Where does she live? Uh, in the next town over, Wappingers. But anyway, when was the um, last time you actually saw her? Uh, I would say about. Week and a half, two weeks ago, something like that. I don't uh, know. Okay. Like, now, uh, Dave, this Dave is... you are her laundry boy. Okay, I just hate to just put it out there. What does that mean, laundry boy? Basically, when she needs her laundry it's, 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 done. Whenever I want to go out and do something, whenever I want to go and do something. Yes, you've said that. Never, I, you, ever we, you, you've made your point, Dave. We know you like to repeat yourself. But let's see if we can discern some more information whenever about you your situation. Whenever you want to do something with her, she's not available. But whenever she needs something done, like her lawn mode or her laundry done, all of a sudden she wants to be with you. So you are a free source of male labor for her. When's the last time you had sex with her, Dave? That's none of your business, but it seems like, you know, I want to go When's the last time you got a kiss around. from her, Dave? Again, none of your business. Dave, this is important. Um, but, but, this this is important information to the conversation. If you don't want to give up information about when you had sex, I get that. That's personal. But a kiss? Come on. When was the last time you got a kiss from this girl who was your ostensible girlfriend? Uh, a couple weeks ago. A couple weeks ago. Yeah. All right, so you know, you've only seen her in the last week and a half, two weeks. You saw her. She did give you a kiss. Was it a peck on the, the lips, a peck on the cheek, or an actual, like, tongue-on-tongue French kiss? It was an, an actual, like, you know, like a real, a real kiss. You a know? real not, kiss. Not, not, not okay. like a, yes. So, but like, and you, and know, you haven't yet actually talked to her about this. Not yet, but, like, whenever I want to go do something, hang out with friends, go yes, to the Yes, you've said that already. Yes. It's now the fourth time. That, uh, that you said that. So what do you want from us, Dave? Do you want us to give you some sort of advice here? What are you looking for? Yeah, advice, what, What's maybe? her phone number, know. Dave? <laughs> no, don't do that. No, no, actually, no, let's you. get her on the air. <laughs> let's get her on the air, and then we can hash oh, this out. that's not a bad idea. All right, stand by, Dave. We'll, uh, we'll see if we can figure this out. 855-453, 855-450-3733. We'll see if we can get Dave's girlfriend's phone number. <laughs> Dial in and join us here. We actually have Dave in New York, who has called himself almost single tonight. Uh, we put him on hold there during the news. We're going to bring him back. He's having some issues with his girlfriend. And this is the same Dave who's called the show over the last few years on a variety of different subjects. Usually he's very, very upset. In the past, Dave was upset because he didn't have a girlfriend. Now, Dave, you're upset because you do have a, a girlfriend and she's not... Uh, she's not doing exactly what uh, you want her to do, which is to be responsive. You say she's not uh, taking your calls. You haven't seen her in like a week and a half, but yet when she wants something out of you, uh, she will go ahead and call you. Is that right, Dave? A relationship is based on a, a two-way street, not a one-way street. A relationship is a two-way street where you guys do things together, not a take me here, take me there kind of thing. Yep, it uh, it absolutely is a uh, two way street. You do have to have communication, and it doesn't really sound much like uh, like you have communication going on in this relationship. Now, was in the beginning. How long is this? How have you been together with her? Uh, I'd say a little over two and a half, three years, something like that. 
Wait a minute, that's not true. Wait, you, wait Dave, you, I think I think I remember a video you posted where you were talking about what you wanted in a girlfriend. I don't think that's more than on his YouTube channel. Yeah, a year old or something. Do you remember that video, Dave? Uh, it was all uh, right. Uh, maybe maybe like uh, I've, I've been we, we've been going out for a little over two years, something like that. I think but you're anyway, lying to us, Dave. Um, I don't think you actually have I'm a girlfriend. Lying. Yes, I do. Yes, I no, do. Because because what's what's she, her name and phone number? I'll give her a yeah, call. Yeah, well, you asked you for her number during the uh, during the news there, and you refused to give. Oh, sorry, TJ, I had your mic muted. Oh, Go okay, ahead. thank you. I managed to find Dave's girlfriend right here. I don't think Dave's girlfriend is a chipmunk. I mean, come on. That's obviously not Dave's girlfriend. No, it's it said Dave, and he has a restraining order against him. <laughs> no, I don't. No, I don't. All right. But, like, but like, she is never around when I want to go out and do something, you know, like hang out with friends or whatever. A relationship is supposed to be based. Uh, it's a two-way street, not a one-way yeah. street where, you know. So you're talking about breaking up with here, her. Take me there. What? So you're talking about breaking up with her over this. I might. I don't know because, like, I never hear from her. I don't see her for her. But, but, like, you know, when she needs something done, oh, oh can you take me here? Can yeah, you take me yeah, there? You said that already. Just uh, dump her, Dave, and then uh, see how she reacts and then call us back and let <laughs> us know. Good luck, Dave. Thanks for the call tonight.